Hey everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and this video, it talks about how challenging guns make Battlefield 5 fun. And the gun that comes to mind is the M30 drilling, because it has the two shells and the rifle bullet. It's a very challenging gun to use. But, once you get good at it, you feel amazing, and you're good at a weird gun, so it throws people off, you know? There's the other guns, like, I would say the M1A1's kind of a weird gun, but kind of not, you know? You got the MMGs, a completely new way of using mounted machine guns and LMGs together. And, of course, the, the greatest pistol, the Liberator, you know. So all those guns, they're kind of weird, but I think they make Battlefield more fun. I like that there's, you know, they don't, I don't feel like they take away, like, oh, you could have put in, like, a Nambu instead of a Liberator and had another for serious pistol, you know? Or, you know, you got that double barrel shotgun in there with a rifle bullet, but you could have put in a different shotgun, you know? Nothing like that. I really don't feel like that's the case. I feel like they add layers to the game beyond just, you have to play to win every time. You know, there's ways to challenge yourself and you're rewarded if you do good at those. I mean, I can use the drilling. Me and Rag, we played Squad Conquest, which I'm sad that it's gone. I wish it stayed. And it, it, the lobby broke, and it was a 2v3. And we both just used the drilling with the rifle bullet, and we won the game. I mean, that kind of stuff, that's kind of like the only in Battlefield moments, but with challenging weapons instead of planes and tanks flying around everywhere and stuff happening, you know? And I really, really like that about challenging weapons. And I'd, I'd encourage you guys to try them out. You might find that you're better at some, or worse than some. Uh, you know, you never know. You know. It was like that in Battlefield 1. There was weapons that were very clearly you know, the Ross MK3 sniper rifle, and the Hell Regal, and the RSC, and some other weapons that were obviously very good guns. Like, extremely good guns. But then there was some guns that were really kind of cool to mess around with. The Calibri, of course. But then some other guns, like the, there's a sniper rifle. I called it the Venetri because I couldn't say its name. With iron sights. It was such a weird sniper rifle that I wanted to use it because it was just so weird. Or, you know, another weird gun that I guess it was a for serious and a weird gun at the same time was the shot shot. The LMG that fired super slow but packed a punch, that was a cool gun to use. You know, it's a lot of fun and challenging and rewarding to use all at once. And, you know, that's the main thing about these guns, is I feel like the challenge guns, they're not all garbage. But even the ones that are, it's always satisfying to get really good at them. Well, I'm happy about that. Thank you for adding those in, developers of Battlefield 5. And that's really it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more videos on Battlefield 5. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I'll see you in the next episode of Stream Vlog or Steam It Post. How about I decide to make?